the second of the really big ones then next it's the Queen Mother Champion Chase two miles of course grade one of the top one cash back for David Hooley cipher rate for John Morgan distance up for Craig Allen Evelith Carter for James Shea Gold Day of System Craig Allen Green Wizard for Craig Beckwith high intensity for Ryan Tamasevi that's the favourite Jack Sparrow for the same trainer David Robertson's got two Moomba Ledge Happy and Maya Lesciotto the Count for Joshua Sutherland the Great Grey for Ryan Costello Black Ascoli for Martin Needham Chessfully on Van Rensburg Concentration Manor for Vinnie Gerard Fiorenti Paul Rhodes five points Darren Thompson, Night Star Ryan Costello, the magician Joshua Sutherland, and Vanilla Delight for John Morgan. So 20 is quite a big field for this. I don't want to get this many in the champion chase, but it should be a good one. Also, there's probably no real standout obvious winner, and they're away and racing. And this one could be pretty excited as they get down to the first and there's a fauna already, there's two fallers already, Evelith Carter and Fiorenti have both gone at the first, so I wasn't quite expecting to be that exciting that quick as they get to number two and they've all gone over the other side of that one and Vanilla Delight one of four greys actually is in the lead and being chased by the David Robertson pair, Moon Ledge happy the one wide on the track, while Lesciotto over on this near side with the other John Morgan grey cipherate and Jack Sparrow is also in that little group as they take the third in front of the stand and he's gone Cyphrate's gone so three of them out already as they take the fence it'll be the last on the next circuit and would you believe it these are supposed to be the champion two mile chases and three of them have already managed to get rid of their jockey before they've even got a mile so it's Vanilla Delight in the lead then from Moon Belledge Happy in second while Lesciotto in third and Jack Sparrow in fourth as they take the next and there was another mistake there this time by Moir Lesciotto they're going pretty quick and Vanilla Delight is the one that is setting that pace Jack Sparrow is in second and Moon Belledge Happy is third while Lesciotto is back in fourth then the Magician and Golden Ray of System then comes Black Ascoli and the Count the Great Greys after that one as they take number six which the remaining horses all get over Concentration Manor is the back marker and appears to be out of shot at this stage as they get to the water which obviously they all get over okay and it's Vanilla Delight and Jack Sparrow in front from the David Robertson pair Moir Lesciotto and Moomba Ledge Happy then comes the Magician and Black Ascoli as they come to this ditch and over that one they go and there's another one gone there and it's Chess Chess has gone Leon Van Rensburg's horse is out of the race so the fallers continue to come thick and fast as they get over the next and over that one they go and it's Vanilla Delight who's in the lead Vanilla Delight there and from Wallace Yotto on the outside second Jack Sparrow between the two of them is third and then comes Moonbledge Happy in fourth they've still got a fair old way to go and they're pretty well strung out and it's Vanilla Delight over that ditch in the lead from in second place Wallace Yotto Jack Sparrow is third Moonbledge Happy is fourth the Great Grey trying to run on then the Count then the Magician then Golden Nail System Black Ascoli and Nightstar trying to run on then Cashback high intensity the favourite's got work to do after that one is five points distance up green Wizard are well out the back, but it's Vanilla Delight who's still in the lead. Only three to jump then now. And Vanilla Delight's in the lead. The field though beginning to close. Vanilla Delight over to third, last in the lead. From the Great Grey, then the Magician on the outside. Jack Sparrow then comes on the outside. The Count trying to get into it as well. Marles Yotto's still there. Night Star's trying to run on and also the favourite now is trying to get into it. High intensity, but it's the two greys in the lead. It's Vanilla Delight from the Great Grey with two to jump. And Vanilla Delight's in front. Now the Magician moves through in a second. Jack Sparrow runs on again in third then the count moon Ledge, happy high intensity is getting closer so to his five points they're coming down towards the final couple of fences over it they go and vanilla delight in the lead vanilla delight from the magician in second the great grey's got itself boxing as they get over the final fence is the magician's hit the front the magician from jack sparrow the magician racing up the hill now in the lead from jack sparrow vanilla delight and the great grey is the magician who's in front it's going to be another one for joshua sutherland as they race up towards the line it's the magician that takes the champion chase the magician takes it five points on a world to be second then the great grand jack sparrow in a big race then the field is going to trail all the way back to concentration manner who's finished a mile behind the rest of them but an action pack race with fallers galore early on and the magician takes it and joshua sutherland is fast becoming the magician of cheltenham festival day one that's his third winner and he's clear at the top the magician takes it Five points were second for Darren Thompson. Ryan Costello gets probably his best 
performance ever at Cheltenham so far. I would think that a great grey in third. High intensity, the favourite. Left far too much to do. Finished fourth for Ryan Tamasevi. He also got fifth with his outsider, Jax Barra. So Joshua Sutherland goes to the top of the champion trainers table at Cheltenham with three wins out of their first 11 races. <laughs>